The US federal employees received pay stubs with nothing but zeros on them on Friday as the effects of the government shutdown hit home, deepening anxieties about mortgage payments and unpaid bills. It's a lot on everybody and everybody's just trying to hang in there and hopefully there's some resolution uh, to this uh, shutdown soon because um, if it goes on for months, I mean, I, I can only imagine what's going to happen to morale because it's already the lowest I've ever seen it. An estimated 8 lakh government employees missed their paychecks for the first time since the shutdown. We saw that the government is actually sending out pay stubs with zero dollars, almost worse than not having it. The shutdown has completed three weeks and has entered into the fourth week, increasing the hardships of federal employees. Just very frustrating to effectively be told that for a policy initiative, you know, a policy initiative is more important than putting food on my daughter's table or putting clothes on my daughter's back or putting a roof over her head. You know, we bought a house uh, here in Alexandria um, back in August, and you know, mortgage payment is going to come due at the end of the month, and I'm pretty sure that we'll be fine making that payment. I don't know what happens down the road. They are her care providers. Um. This weekend, it will become the longest shutdown in U.S. history. We shouldn't have to be here this morning. Um, you know, as of I think some point today, this is going to become the longest government shutdown in American history. After leaving the U.S. Peace Corps, uh, having served in Ukraine, teaching English, people have already missed car payments. People have already been unable to pay their daycare providers because they're stockpiling money just so that they can pay for food, not knowing how long this is going to go on. Most of the government workers received their last paycheck two weeks ago. I'm scared. Uh, I've been planning, but I will say since uh, the day, you know, that Friday night when we went into government shutdown, Christmas was not a relaxing time for me. I've been really nervous. Um, I was happy we got that first paycheck after Christmas for um, the work that we had done, um, but I was planning for the fact that we might not get this one, and I'm glad I did that because, um, you know, I made all of the essential payments and I still have some funds to make sure we can, you know, pay for food for the kids, um, but it's scary, and it's scary not knowing when I will get paid next. Members of Michigan's congressional delegation met U.S. federal workers affected by three-week government shutdown. They discussed about the shutdown and how to tackle it. Everybody is concerned and hoping that the shutdown will end soon and we would be back at our, our jobs and, and serving the American public. Some airports are also trying to help their unpaid federal employees. An ETV Bharat report.